Okay, so let's make a quick tutorial on how to create a weapon, a melee weapon from scratch with the animal controller. So right now I have downloaded here on make some of these Promele Axe animations. And let's see what we got. I have converted all of them to humanoid so we can use it. And now Searching here, I'm going to use this animation right here. Let me bake the root of this animation here. Let me rename it also because all of them are are called mixama.com. Here, bake the Y position. and this one yeah we can use this one too here and let's use another one for fun okay right here and use these ones so let me put it in another folder so i can know that know it now let's create a weapon i'm going to use well just a cylinder as a mesh so you can use any any weapon you have so Let's create an empty game object here. Let's call it new axe. And inside I'm going to create a cylinder. Yep. Put it right here. Cylinder two. Down, set something like this. Well, copy this because we want the weapon to be to be zero zero zero. And this one right here, we need it to be all the modifications that we need. Set it. Perfect. Now, this is tag animal. No, I'm going to tag it item. Yes. Now we need to add the melee weapon component. What do we need? We need a collider, a, a trigger, so the weapon will hit something. So inside this game object, I'm going to create the tag trigger. And I'm going to add a box collider. Box collider will be the trigger, which is right here. Here, okay, yeah. Zero, zero, zero. This new axe is going to attack with this trigger. So. Something like this. Okay, well, yeah. Now, usually the character is going to hold the weapon in the weapon pivot. So, just I'm going to add a gizmo visualizer to see where where the weapon is going to be held. So it's going to be held right here. So the it should be something like this. Let me scale a bit down this guy again. And the weapon is going to be held here. Now get that trigger. It's going to do something like this. Okay, this 
working perfect now here we need to fill some data now if we use the melee id that means that this weapon is going to use the 100 melee animations which the id is 100 right here 100 100 now we want to use another set of animations so i'm going to create a new id and simply i'm going to duplicate this one right here and i'm going to call it new x and the important thing that we need to change is the id and the name again okay, new x now we need to see which are the ids that are being used so far so we're going to tools marvelous animations show all ideas and here on modes you're gonna see all the ids that we are using now the new axe is using 100 and melee is using 100 so we need to change it so let's go to 103 because it's the the next one available so 103 let me check if we are recording yes now now we now that we have this i'm going to change here in the weapon and i'm going to use new x perfect so far so good what else do we need here we can see how much damage the weapon ha uh, makes and the next thing that we need to check is the ground attacks and riding attacks since we're going to use it only for ground attacks in this tutorial so we need to add the ids that we are going to use for the ground attacks which are the animations that we have now here we have four animations so we are going to create a new state new empty substate machine i'm going to call it new axe and here we're going to add all our new animations perfect i don't know the order but there they are now we need to add this to the character and we need to set the proper transitions and all the the components and the animator behaviors so for this we are going to go to tools Marvel animations and we're going to use the animation tools now let's select your character in this case will be Steve because we're going to add automatically all the new animations and modes here and also in the animator controller we're going to add the correct transition so we're going to modes we're going to select our new mode which is in weapons new axe with the ID 103 and now we're going to select the animations and we're going to have here the IDs that we need. It's going to be one, two, three, four, the names. All of this, we're going to do it without deselecting these animations. So we add the entry transitions, we add the mode behavior. We are going to add the exit default transition in this case the most third status equals to minus two is the old way to use it so we're not going to add it if you want to add it then you you add it but it's not necessary so uh, any longer these animations are not like eating or drinking so you can for example hold a key down and you loop it until you release the key so 
we are not going to add the loop transition we are going to add the mode to the animal component so Steve had the mode already set and we are going to add the new interrupt transition which means that for example to enter to these animations the mode is equal to 103.001 and we'll and this one will be the same one but the condition will be not equal so let's check right here we're going to add it and this is all the things you need to do so far now like i was saying the mode is equal to 103002 and to interrupt it is not equal to 103002 perfect and now if we go to steve we see that we have a new mode with all the new abilities perfect now here on the limits if you want and if you really need it you can add for example that we can only attack with this weapon when we are on the idle state and on the locomotion state so we if we are jumping or falling or swimming the weapon cannot be used now back to the weapon we haven't set the combos yet so let's do the first way of doing the attacks without a combo so we have here on on steve if you go back to the most you have one two three and four perfect so on the axe we just need to add four abilities one two three and four okay what else do we need we need to pick this weapon so let's add a pickable item and let's add a rigid body And let's add a collider, a box collider for this pickable item. So the weapon should be something like this, the collider for the weapon. Really strange that the collider is white, but whatever is a, it's a unity version that we don't know what they broke. Okay, it's back again to the color. <laughs> I don't know why. Again, let's. It should be something like this size. Okay. If we hit play, you need the. My God. And I didn't save. Well, this is the first part of the video. <laughs>